We're gonna go in and pick up the rings now. Are you excited? Very excited. How much do you want to marry me? Uh, just uh, not very much. No. <laughs> <laughs> Today is my hen's party, so all of the girls have surprised me with a little day out. This is Jen. She's my sister-in-law, so Hello. Jen's <laughs> And Tina and Ella. <laughs> and we are waiting for the bus to come and pick us up to go somewhere. It's a surprise! <laughs> <laughs> the bus driver's all yours. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello. Essential. Oh, I got my gifts. We have penis straw. Can you hold my penis straw? Mommy, can you hold my penis straw? Is there some water in case we drink a little bit too much wine, Kirsten? Yeah. So we've just arrived at Sirame Winery. It's perfect day weather. This is Kirsten's organized this whole thing. She's amazing. Tara. You need to give me some marital advice. What is your one tip for a successful marriage? Laughter. Yeah. Yep. As long as you can laugh together, <laughs> have a joy, then you'll have you'll a happy, happy for many years. To drink. Happy life. Happy wife. Happy, happy life. life. Happy life. I think when there is champagne and cheese, there is happiness. As long as there is alcohol, <laughs> you'll be fine. What is your one piece of advice for a great wedding day? Oh, don't stress. Don't like, stress. Laugh. Make like jokes and laugh and have a good time. Relax and just enjoy the day. I think for the wedding day, the biggest thing is you want to make sure you enjoy it. You want to make sure you had take the time just to appreciate the moment and don't worry about everybody else. We're only get married once. Hopefully. Hopefully. All well, goes well. Well, I haven't been married, but... That's okay. Just have fun and take it all in and enjoy it while you can it's only one day communication yeah. always communicate good. Yeah. and be honest and you'll be married forever okay it's true take huge enjoyment in yeah <laughs> what did you say to your heart's desire did you hear that never let the sex life get tired yeah. <laughs> keep it interesting I don't know if I was supposed to bring my champagne yeah <laughs> You went a steak too good. I love a good steak. Yeah, I think so. I ordered the fish and the dumpling. Why do you like some sort of tom yum? Just different. What's wrong with your balls, Tina? Up and down. Oh, so am I. They're not fully descended. Aren't they usually like one goes up and one goes down for heat? Like I guess we just have to appreciate that everybody's anatomy is different. Hello. Hi. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Hi guys. We are just on the way to Brisbane. We've got a really big day planned today. Yeah. We Daddy. just had Daddy. We just had gymnastics. Valia does gymnastics once a week and absolutely loves it. She's so funny. Half of the time she doesn't follow instruction, but it's very cute to watch. So she's just having a little bottle. Hopefully she's going to have a nice sleep in the car on the way. We are going to Xenox Diamonds to pick up our wedding rings. My um, engagement ring has been there for so long now just to get the um, wedding band made because the wedding band that I wanted didn't fit underneath the engagement ring so I had to have the whole engagement ring moved up so I could have some bigger diamonds. <laughs> First world problems. So it is exactly four weeks until we get married tomorrow. But we still have quite a bit to organize. We've just selected all of our flowers. Everything else is pretty much done. We just have to choose some of the songs for the singer to sing and pick up the groomsmen's shirts. What else do you have to do? Okay. 
<laughs> you didn't see her first. Oh yeah, that was a huge one. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was a burp. Say excuse me. <laughs> if you are planning a destination wedding, I would definitely recommend getting a wedding planner. Makes such a big difference when they know all of the good suppliers in that location and just really streamlines the experience. Um, so we have pretty much finalized everything with her. Flowers, music, um, decorations. Money. We just have to decide on the running of the day and we have to write our vows and get my dress. So my dress, I'm on like the sixth appointment now. I've got two more appointments and I'm gonna stay in Sydney overnight. Um, so if they wanna make any last changes the week before the wedding, they can. And then, yeah, I picked the dress up a week before the wedding. That's so it will fit you perfectly because your body changes a lot. Um, a lot of brides, lose weight just before the wedding so just to make sure it fits perfectly I um, cannot wait to pick up my dress and um, <laughs> and Avalia's dress too we're picking up Avalia's dress we have decided on our cake flavors for the wedding we are going to go raspberry and caramel mud I never thought I'd have like a raspberry cake but we tried it when we were in Bali and it was so good so we had to go with that one and just caramel for something different. Our cake is gonna be like a five tier with some flowers down the side, like sugar flowers to match our theme. Um, but I'll make sure I show a photo to you guys at the wedding. Well, I'll get someone else to take a photo. I'm not taking any photos, not doing any vlogging or anything on my wedding day. Just wanna really enjoy the day and be present in the moment. I asked um, on Instagram for advice on my wedding day and almost every single person said to take, you know, 10 minutes away from the wedding just with me and Garth and look back and just enjoy it, take in the moment and be really present because it really does go so fast. Um, so just make the most of the day. Everybody clap. Everybody sing. Oh no! La 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 la. Bow to your partner. And then we turn around. Yippee! We're gonna go in and pick up the rings now. Are you excited? Very excited. How much do you want to marry me? Uh, just uh, not very much. No. <laughs> <gasps> Hello, nice to see you guys. Hello. Come in to get our rings. Hello, yeah. These ones are mine. Oh, very nice. So we made uh, a split wedding band for you. We've got uh, two half a carat diamond bands, one on each side. Uh, and they're all in a beautiful platinum setting and mm -hmm. shared claw and that makes the diamonds really pop so all you can see is just the diamonds. Do you wish your ring was like this, Garth? Mm. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> so I wish I could wear them all together now, it's so beautiful. So I've got um, my eternity band and my wedding band with diamonds three quarters of the way to match my ring. And Garth's trying to kiss on. Very nice. Garth wanted something simple for when he's at work. New diamonds for you. <laughs> to make you feel married now? Yeah, pretty much. So he's got rose gold and what's that? Brush silver or something? White gold. Oh, white gold. Okay. Oh, blocks. Thank you, Do you like mommy's ring? Pretty. She's a mother's daughter. She's going to the Yeah. <laughs> scares with losing the rings one time putting a hand into the baby bag and pulling it out without the ring and didn't realize until a good few hours later we searched the entire house and eventually found it in the baby bag two weeks after we were engaged two weeks after and i lost the ring going to see where all the done Yeah. 
have to surprise me with these beautiful flowers. What a gentleman. Like my new wedding bands for my wedding ring aren't enough. Some chockies. Thank you, Baba, for my beautiful flowers. I'm so lucky. Now I'm gonna eat this whole bag of chocolates on the way in. Seriously though, how beautiful are these flowers? 